Hi, I'm Emily Rose. And I'm Dan Filgreen. Welcome to the weekend edition of Shell Point Today for September 27, 28, and 29. We're pulling out all the stops for this special weekend edition. That includes a conversation with Michelle Tompkins, who's counting down to the return of Active Aging Week. Our residents are going to be invited and offered this um, program that you're going to be coming out to our beach, our island beach with some paddle boards. Director of Employee Ministry Jim Clark is in full preparation mode for his Coffee with a Neighbor presentation. To you know, be a, a chaplain, be able to care for employees when they're going through tough times. We're getting a sneak peek at the brand new dining menus coming to Shell Point's restaurants. Plus, we're recapping some of the top stories from the past week. But first, we're going out in style for a look back on this day in history. It was 1960 when legendary Red Sox slugger Ted Williams wrapped up his illustrious career by hitting a home run in his final at bat. For 21 years, Williams earned his reputation as the best hitter in the game, winning the American League MVP twice and becoming the last man to ever have a 400 batting average for a season. However, it was in 1960 when the splendid splinter announced that he was going to hang up the cleats. After a quick salute to the crowd, Ted smacked a shot deep into Fenway Park for his 521st career home run. The final image of Williams' career was him circling the bases as a happy Boston crowd cheered him into retirement. To this day, there is one lone red chair in Fenway Park Stadium dedicated to where the final home run of Ted Williams' career landed. Just like on Green Acres, Shell Point's getting ready to get up close and personal with farm life. This Monday, there might still be a spot available for a day learning more about produce and livestock by heading to Southern Fresh Farms. Your trip begins with brunch at Zoe's Kitchen for a fresh take on Mediterranean-style cuisine. Then head down the road to Southern Fresh Farms for a wagon tour and learn the different techniques used to grow fresh produce. Then you can head to their barnyard to meet some of the farm's furry residents that have been rescued over the years. If you've already registered for this trip, remember that court pickups begin at 10.05 on the island. If you want to see if a spot is available, then simply call 454-2282 and sign up for Monday's trip to Southern Fresh Farms. Also coming up this Monday, get ready to get moving because Active Aging Week is here. From September 30th through October 4th, Every Shell Point resident will be able to sign up for a variety of programs and events with a focus on keeping you fit and healthy. Things kick off on the 30th at 8.30 in the morning with a Woodlands Trail Walk and Outdoor Workout. Then what follows is an amazing assortment of health-minded trips, classes, and lectures. For a complete list of all the action coming to Shell Point for this, week, this Active Aging Week, head to shellpoint.net and click on the Active Aging Week link in the announcement page. One of those interesting presentations surrounds the outdoor fun of paddleboarding. Recently, Michelle Tompkins met with Roy Massey of Ace Performance to see what this program will entail. 